Howdy and welcome to another postcard from Moorhead. I'm Larry Dixon and what's on the menu today, what inspired this was uh, my sister and brother-in-law and I, we went to New Orleans a week or two ago and had some alligator and I found me some alligator. So that's what's on the menu today. It uh, says wild caught alligator. So that's uh, what's going in there. I'm going to uh, prepare this alligator in Louisiana crispy fish fry breading mix. I'm going to cheat on the rice. I'm going to use uh, this Kroger 90 seconds microwave Spanish style rice. What else do I need? I've got some olive oil here and I'm going to deep fry this in a shallow pan. Just like that right there. And while I was in New Orleans, uh, they put me on to a new hot sauce that I had never tried before. And it's called Crystal Hot Sauce. I tasted it while I was there in, in New Orleans. Not bad stuff. So we're going to have uh, alligator and rice is what's on the menu today. So the first thing I need to do is put... Uh, some of this breading mix in my little bowl. May not need all of it, so I'm going to use it sparingly. And my alligator. And let's see what we, uh, it pulls apart. I'm going to put it in there. Coat it really well, shake off the excess. And I'm going to set it over here to the side and uh, let that breading mix adhere to my alligator. Looks like these are some decent sized pieces of alligator. Bread it up real nicely. So I'm going to finish breading up uh, my alligator and we're going to come back in a minute after I uh, get this braided up, and we'll go to the next step. Well, I have finished step one. I have braided up my alligator, and it's looking pretty nice. I'm, like I said, I'm letting it rest, so the, uh, the batter will stick. I'm going to pour some oil in my little shallow pot so I can deep fry, and I'm going to... Uh, raise the temperature of my oil to 350 degrees so I can get a nice deep fry on my alligator. How do I know when I reach 350? I've got my handy dandy little thermal thermometer and right now we are at 67 degrees so it's going to take a few minutes and I'll be back after my oil heats up and we're ready to put our alligator in this shallow deep fry. My oil has come up to temp and I am ready to fry up some alligator that has been seasoned with uh, Louisiana fish fry seafood breading mix. So let's move over and uh, do a little frying of my alligator. Oh, listen to that sizzle. That is perfect. I'm going to get some crispy alligator. I'm going to have to fry this up in about three batches because my pot's small, but I planned it that way. I didn't want to pull out my deep fryer. I'm going to let it fry up for two or three minutes. Check my temperature. I'm down to about 308, but that temperature is going to come right back up. Now these small pieces are frying up real nice. And I'm going to give it a try. Hmm. That's good. This first batch that I've got in there, there's three or four pieces of alligator. And it is frying up nicely. 
I think it's time to uh, put my rice in there, my 90 second rice, Spanish rice. I'm doing it the cheap way, easy way today. And 90 seconds. Oh yeah, these these three pieces are, are looking mighty good. I'm just going to put them on the rack right here. Let's look at this big piece. Oh, he needs to fry up some more. I'm going to put a really large piece in there. Check my oil temperature. Oh, I need to bring that temperature up. That last piece was cold, so it really dropped the temperature of my oil. I'm going to try a little bit of this uh, crystal hot sauce on this. Now, Lenore, my official taste tester, she's not going to be here today. She does not like seafood, fish. Well, she likes it, but it doesn't like her. So let's see what this little bite's going to be. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's good. I can't wait for the rest of this to fry up. I'm going to try to dump out a little bit of rice. There we go. So let's try this instant rice that's in a bag, and it is hot. I think I like it better without the rice. Let's give it one more taste test. Mmm. Mmm. Lenore doesn't know what she's missing. Well, that's what's been on the menu today, alligator, and I really like this crystal hot sauce. I like Frank's hot sauce, but this is equal to, if not a little bit better, alligator and rice for lunch today. Postcard from Moorhead. Don't forget to hit that subscribe and that like button, and I'll catch you down the road. I'm going to have some more alligator. Hit that subscribe and like button. Mmm.